Hello friends, Andrew Demeter here today with a coffee shop chatbot template. So I'm gonna click get started here. And this template is designed for someone obviously who owns a coffee shop, but also it's built for marketing agencies or even individual freelancers who are running social media campaigns for coffee shops. So right off the bat here, we have this personalized greeting for the user based on the current time of day. In this case, it says evening because it's about 4 p.m. And then we also greet them based on their first name. Next, as you can already see, we show them the branded logo of the coffee shop and also a snippet, a blurb of the brand story. All of this text and imagery is fully customizable, easy drag and drop interface. So it's great for whatever you need to fit your branding. Next, the thing that users will see here is this mysterious but enticing call to action button, right? Claim free gift. So I'm going to click that. And once I do, it's going to prompt me to enter in my birthday. So I'm going to do that by clicking here. I'll say January 10th, 1990. I click save. It's going to echo that date that I just entered in Facebook Messenger back to me, and it's gonna say, hey, stay tuned for a special offer, right? So it goes without saying that at this point in the bot, we've captured this extremely valuable marketing data because it allows us to basically promote timely offers and promotions. So for example, if I type in birthday seven, and users won't actually be typing this, this is just for demonstrational purposes. So if I type this in, it's gonna show me the message that we can send automatically to users seven days before their actual birthday. So this is a perfect opportunity to say something like, hey, your birthday's coming up. Do you wanna schedule a celebration? You know, something to that effect. Alternatively or simultaneously, if I type in birthday here, this is the message that will get sent to the user on their birthday itself. So this is another great timely opportunity to say something like, hey, stop in for a free cup of coffee on us, stop in for a free bagel, a breakfast, something to that effect to ultimately build that customer loyalty and increase their lifetime value. Now let's skip ahead to the main menu here. Obviously another utility of this bot is the ability to order food and drink within Facebook Messenger. So let's say that I want a bagel. I can click here to browse. Right now it's going to say, hey, sorry, it's outside of the hours in which you can order a bagel. And this is totally fine because obviously certain menu items are going to be restricted. So this is the purpose that that serves. But say that I instead want to order a snack, I can click here on anytime snacks, which obviously aren't time restricted. Once I do that, let's say that I want the avocado split right here. I'm going to click to buy. Obviously, my first and last name is pre-populated. That's one less thing I have to enter. All I have to enter here is my email and credit card details to complete the transaction. Now, something that works in tandem with this is if I type in sequence here, this is the message that will get sent to the user one day after they place this order in Messenger. So if I were to actually buy this avocado split, it would say this, Andrew, did you enjoy your avocado split yesterday? Yesterday. Obviously, if I enjoyed it, I can say, yeah, I click that button right here. And it's going to say, okay, great. Thanks. We love hearing that. Thanks for your feedback. And then it's also going to say this, right? If you'd like to win a free breakfast on us, so giving the user some sort of incentive to do this, then share a photo of what you ordered, the avocado split in this case, and tag us. So this is a genius placement right here to build brand awareness on social media. Have people tagging you on Facebook, Instagram, you know, Twitter, whatever the case might be. This is a great opportunity to do that and obviously give them some sort of incentive by doing a weekly, a monthly, a bi-weekly drawing, some sort of thing like that. Now I'm going to type in sequence one more time here. And when I do this, this time I'm gonna say, you know, no, I absolutely hated what I ordered. So I'm gonna click that button and it's gonna come back basically giving me a way to remedy that as the user, as the customer. So in this case, it's gonna say, hey, you know, we're giving you a free whatever you ordered and didn't like on the house. Obviously you can change this messaging if you wanna say, hey, you know, we'll give you whatever you want on the menu for free, something like that. Or alternatively, you could give them some sort of discount coupon, something like that, or just say, sorry, you know, how can we make it better? So that that is the follow-up sequence here for ordering. And then one final thing I want to show you in the bot here is the NLP, the natural language processing. This is essentially if the user has a frequently asked question, they type it in free form instead of relying on these buttons and menus, the bot can intelligently respond to that. So for example, what's, or rather, let's say, uh, what vegetarian options do you have? You'll notice I'm typing this in part in broken English just to show the robustness and power of this natural language processing engine. So in this case, it says, hey, what type of vegetarian food do you want? I'll say sandwiches, and obviously it'll give me those relevant answers right here. I can scroll through, and if necessary, I can just click to buy as I previously showed. 
I'll ask a couple more questions here. For example, uh, are you currently open? Obviously this would be useful if somebody just comes to your Facebook page, they ask this not knowing there's a bot and it says, okay, you know, yes, we're currently open, gives us those business hours and we are good to go. One final thing that I'll ask is what's your address, for example. And if I type that in, it's gonna come back giving the user the address they requested, but also if they wanna take it one step further, they can click here to get directions. They enter their GPS location and it'll give them step-by-step -step directions to the coffee shop via Google Maps. So that's pretty much all this chatbot has to offer. Just to recap the key features here, obviously right in the onboarding, we have that personalized time-based messaging based on morning, evening, afternoon, etc. And then, well, actually those are the only three options, morning, afternoon, and evening. We also have birthday offers so users can enter their birthday and then based on their birthday coming up or on the birthday itself, we can send them those offers and promotions. In addition to that, people can buy food and drink natively and try transact natively right within Facebook Messenger here. We also have the time restricted menu option. So if the user is trying to buy something outside of the hours in which they can order, that's totally fine. We tell them accordingly. And then finally, we have the natural language processing intents, the basic frequently asked questions here, such as, you know, what's your address? Are you currently open? That sort of stuff. What's your phone number? All those sort of things. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you have any questions about this chatbot template, let me know. Otherwise, take care.